I promise you nothing could have prepared you for this video. Absolutely nothing. You guys have no idea what's in... Oh, wait, you see... <laughs> you can see a little bit because the green screen is actually uh, projecting to the thing because that's a green screen in the back. That's funny. Um, but you still wouldn't know what the heck I'm talking about. This game has had me pretty much addicted for the last couple of days. And it's on sale. Well, it was on sale. If it's not on sale, I deeply apologize. The title would be somewhat misleading, but it was on sale for a dollar. And if it still is, I, I advise you to go get it, especially if you have a PC. It actually is also on, I think, iOS, not on Android, but on iOS for $10. This game is Bloons Tower Defense 6. This game I've played, and when I was mentioning in my last Exos video, is that I played it when it was the first version of it, uh, Balloons Power Defense, when it was there was no numbers attached to it on Congregate. Back in the day, uh, man, when you would just play a game and you'd get all the good gushy stuff, man. So what we're going to do is I'm going to go in here, try a map, I'm going to try some nonsense that you guys uh, either have seen or not, I explain what I can, uh, but at the end of the day, man, uh, <laughs> that's going to be so weird seeing that little piece. I'm going to take my green screen effect off, hold on. There we go. And we are going to play some balloons. I want to show you this guy game and just have some fun, man. I haven't had fun in a bit. So without further ado, let's get a Mariki Dinky do. Let's get into it. What's going on guys, it's your boy Cash, and this is Balloons Tower Defense. This is one of the many maps which I will show a little bit later uh, what the other maps look like. Uh, well, not like in de full detail, but this is like the basic one. You start off with a really basic uh, map. You have a bunch of these guys, which you unlock very quickly. They just want to give you the basic, and you start off with these basic monkeys, as you can see in the blue, and then you get some of the green, and you get some of the purple, and then you get these yellow ones. And you can make your own comp. There's no, like, best... I mean, it probably is the best way to do it, but uh, there's many ways to beat these stages. Now, this is a challenge uh, that I'm doing. It's alternate balloon round, so uh, I'm just going to go out with my hero. My hero is Quincy, and I'll show you guys the other heroes as well. He's just a really good starter. He's really efficient. I'm playing on hard difficulty. So I wanted to go uh, put my best foot forward. So this guy's pretty darn good. Now what I'm going to be trying to do, oh wow, that's like so many random balloons. So pretty much the objective is just they, you know, monkey pop balloons, you have 100 life. Some levels or difficulties have different uh, things attached to them. Uh, I'm gonna be doing 80 rounds. It's gonna be sped up. Uh, oh wait, I it's supposed to be sped up. I, it would be if I actually pressed the speed, speed up button. So as you can see, the he has to sit there and pop all the balloons, and he levels up. That's how your hero works. Okay. That's actually pretty dirty. That's dirty. Those are camo balloons. I'm gonna just Seriously? take the hit for that. Um, I could actually have stopped that. No, I actually couldn't. I need 540 for a ninja monkey who can actually see camo. Uh, so I never did this stage before, so technically... Um, it would have been good for me to have uh, that one and the that monkey this monkey is pretty good to start off with but oh my oh This is a little crazy. Oh my god the camels again That's so dirty. Oh, that's dirty. What would I do for that? He actually I think at level I Think I might have to spend it. I think at level four or something like that he actually can see that. This is actually pretty messed up. All right. So they get camel early. Uh, let's see. A good way to counter camo is actually the mortar. And I'm going to set the mortar to shoot here. Now, even though they can't see it, you can still pop it because it's a mortar. <laughs> Now let's go into the next level of this game. So you can actually upgrade the towers in three different ways. Uh, once you go, I think, three into one side, you can only do two on something else. So uh, this mortar, I want it to just shoot really a lot of times. So I'm going to go with the fast reload uh, just so it can shoot as many times as possible. And I'm going to keep leveling that up because I that's what I value. Also, these lead balloons. Oh, God. Seriously? Okay, so those also get popped. So those are actually a pretty good thing. So this is a, this is a pretty a good way to counter camo is actually the mortar early round. As you can see, those are the stealth ones, and they went by again. Oh my! Can you stop saying that? I still can't see camo yet. It's gonna level that up, so it shoots more. Yes. 
I got 29 HP. I don't know if I'm gonna make it this run. What is this? So, let's see what else I can do. So I wanna go, like I said, fast, 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 fast. But I also wanna do something, increase accuracy into Bernie, uh, set booms on fire, this is really good. Or I can go up here uh, where it blows through the layers a little bit more. I'm gonna be going all the way with this one. So it's gonna be, they're gonna be shooting really, really fast. Like I said, I can only go two, and then once I go to this third one, I can't go three here, three here. You can only go max out in one spot. So I'm gonna go like with that. So let me go back here. It's 970. I'm gonna go with the bigger blast. Seriously? Oh wait, I still can't see camo. Bro, level up. See, look, where is it? He can see, eventually he can see stealth. Am I losing my mind? Oh, level five. Yeah. Oh no, I just lost. Oh, it's fine. Come on. And I lost in round fifteen. This one's hard because everything's random. Usually, the, those tougher balloons are come in later. So I'm just gonna restart. You can spend your monkey money to uh, do that. So we know that those things are coming early. So it might be better to just start off with this guy. Really good monkey. He can see camo. We're gonna leak, it's fine. Okay, now, now we don't lose anything on these rounds anymore. There we go, give him some attack speed. Now we know, what is it, like round 18 or something like that? Eventually, they're, we're gonna need something to pop the lead. We need something. Now, what would be the best option for that? And at this point, he's pretty much solid. Oh wait, they come earlier than I thought. How much is that? Ow. Wow, those are really big loss. Okay, I really need something to pop those. <laughs> Instead of the mortar, I'm gonna go with this one. This pretty much should keep us covered for a long time. There we go. All right, these two right here, I think should be able to hold it down for a pretty long time. Yeah, you lose some life. You don't have to win as get a perfect or anything like that, so. And let me introduce you to one of my favorite new monkeys, the engineer monkey, who sets out turrets. What is that, a stealth? Are you fucking kidding me? A stealth sur like lead balloon, so this thing needs to. Okay. Okay. That is so dirty. All right, so I'm gonna get this thing called the Monkey Village. Which I can get them. I can boost this things uh, so they can see stealth. I'll show you guys uh, this thing. So all monkeys within its radius will be able to see. Thing. I don't know if this thing counts as a monkey. I'm pretty sure maybe it doesn't, uh, but it will definitely help me with that. Or I just lose. Maybe I should. <laughs> oh, man. Well, I can't get a break. <laughs>
maybe I'll, I'll finish that in another video this is going on for too long but as you can see there's actually different heroes in the game uh, you do start off with Quincy but there's your uh, Gwendolyn uh, she's like about fire so she's actually not that bad she's actually really strong but she costs as you can see 900 to start to I couldn't even use her first in that map if I wanted to uh, you got this guy he's 750 you know he has a mortar so he's pretty good got a you know forest guardian there's like a tech guy uh, I need 5,000 cash which you actually get the cash as you got I'll show you guys in a second but you get it pretty much through playing you can spend money more in the game if you want to to get things a little bit quicker Captain Churchill Benjamin L L Ezzy Lee whatever uh, Pat uh, Adora and then there's Admiral Brickhill uh, and they also oh wait they also do have little skins which doesn't really change anything about them it just they just look really cool as they level up you know you could do that so I, this guy he actually has a cool skin where he comes like full cyborg if you want to and they do have different voice lines and stuff like that which is pretty cool uh, definitely a big fan of this also there's powers so you saw how I was struggling in that map there's actually stuff that I could literally get here um, see add for a hundred cash I can spend my cash instead of getting characters I can get this to uh, get an ability uh, get these things insta monkeys uh, these are things that allow you to just summon a monkey pretty much for free uh, it's just to beat those hard stages those challenges you use some other means of you know uh, portable lake is pretty good because there's certain characters that can only go on uh, water surfaces and there's you know whatever these things everything there's different ways that you can play out the map like the road spikes I remember in the older games you'd use the road spikes because they were earlier way to beat certain stages uh, cheaply uh, there is actually co-op I haven't done co-op yet but it's, I, I heard it was just you playing with another person you have separate money so you don't have to you don't share a pool of money or something like that even if you did it's still pretty cool uh, monkey knowledge you can actually upgrade your pretty much your account the more you play you get these uh, as you level up you get these monkey knowledges and I can show you like oh it just boosts up certain stuff you can go in make certain things whatever you like to do like the, the helicopter is really strong uh see monkey aces fly faster you know stuff different things that you can do to upgrade your account um and then you can respect for 2000 you know do all that good stuff and obviously i think you saw here you could plus yes you could spend money to get more of it to to again uh, accelerate your account now most of you guys are from uh my community which is like kind of like gotcha base so you guys are very familiar with this type of thing like uh, you know pretty much spend to enhance your account not to spend or pay to win because there is no pvp in this game not that i know of anyway uh so it's really it's really you know you just if you want to get stuff faster you want to support devs and you know you want to really enjoy the game a little bit more uh these are all like the little monkeys the dark monkey boomerang the boomerang obviously shoots a boomerang but he gets stronger like you can see like instead of the boomerangs, he starts getting glaives, or you can get him to use the glaive lord. These things are usually very expensive. Tax shooter can get it to instead of shooting tax, they shoot fire <laughs> or razor blades or stuff like that. Like it's it's really cool. One of my favorite monkeys, uh, which I started to fall in love with, was the engineer. You can get it to the point where he has all these weird turrets that they're different colors and they like freeze. It's it's like so cool. It's like they freeze fire they do everything depending on whatever you need, and you just send out a bunch of I really wanted to get this paragon thing. Um, and where is it? The banana farm, pretty good. You know, you can have it that they you generate money. Uh, usually I love to go for this upgrade. Oh, I can actually get the banana central, which I don't even know. You want a banana? Have a banana. Shoot. Cool. I, I see. I want to see that. That seems really cool. So I'll show you guys another video of this game. Uh, once I get, uh, you know, after I just want to show you guys that I have it and I want, I want to do another video on it because the game is just really, really cool. Uh, where's my favorite? My, my favorite, favorite, the super monkey. Uh, he turned you can turn him into Batman kind of it's kind of funny or you can turn him into this like dual wielding <laughs> Thing the Sun God Sun avatar or you can turn him into a Sun tech like it's really silly stuff And I think you guys would enjoy it. if it's still a dollar on Steam You guys should definitely pick it up and uh, I will beat next video will be me beating this stupid challenge I will figure out the challenge. and oh yeah, there's all the maps, right? This is the basic map I'm just trying to get everything into one map and then move on to the next one you see tree stump, uh, skates, Lotus uh, Lotus Island, uh, Candy Falls. There's a bunch of maps, carves, and you know you just go through all these maps. There's a bunch of them. See some of them are locked. I don't know if you have to pay money to get lock them. I think you just have to keep playing the game. Look, advanced, intermediate, expert levels where it gets really crazy. I'll just show you guys. This is an intermediate map, just to show you guys, just a, you know, basic, easy. And uh, as you saw, those are challenges, right? So look how crazy this stuff can really get. So the balloons come out here, bounce outwards. You can see you can remove some of this stuff so you can put monkeys in better positions. 
um, and there's just way cool things. Uh, I've said this before in, I think, uh, my first sponsored video that I'm actually a really big fan of tower defense game. There's another gacha tower defense game that's gonna be another, probably one of the last gacha games that I cover. And I'm really looking forward to that one because I, I do love tower defense. I don't like that, you know, there's gonna be like, oh, you need to get this tower kind of thing. I know Arknights was similar to that. Like uh, certain characters were just really strong, made the game really easy and spending money made it too easy. I hope the next one's not like that, which it probably will be, but you know, all cool. You know, I do like this aspect that there's different cool things that you can do in these maps, you know? So that's that. Oh yeah, just to show you guys. Yeah, so each uh, stage has like these challenges, primary only where you can only use the basic monkeys. Deflation has a different thing as well. Then you go to medium, military only, so only those green ones. Apocalypse, reverse, the, you know, stuff, uh, the, everything comes of the opposite end instead. And then as you can see, I'm doing the hard. I had to use only the magic monkeys. I cleared that double HP on the Moabs, which are these big, gigantic balloons. And I'm trying to do alternate rounds, and I, I was eventually going to do half cash, which is going to be really difficult. Uh, these are really hard challenges. And then, you know, you progress to the next stage. And then, boom, I'm going to go into tree stump and do the same thing. So I'm going to get all my little medals and stuff like that. So especially if you guys are playing and want to see me do a specific stage, I will try to do that. Anywho, that's going to be it for me. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this game. I would like to show you guys more of it just for fun. It doesn't have to be like a serious channel. All of a sudden, the, the channel balloons tower defense six nothing like that but hey if you guys want to see some more fun let's have fun that's all i'm saying like comment subscribe and remember that every day the cash you know you like a day and i'll see you guys in the next video peace